Thank you for coming on my page. Thank you very much. I am here to spread the gospel for you guys. You have probably never wanted to hear what Jesus and God want to hear from you. But I am. Jesus is coming quicker than you can imagine. You just can't feel him yet coming if you don't trust him and you don't um, um, love him. Everyone wants to go to heaven. But you never know when something bad happens in your life, like millions of sins, and you don't mean to do them. You don't mean to do them, and you never meant to do them, or you were forced to do them. No, that's all on you. You have a decision in life to follow people's rules, to do sin, or lead to Jesus and do no barely any sins. You should do less than at least one. I've done like three or or I don't know how much sins I've made, but I know I've made a few. Lots of people think that Jesus is not as important as money is. People, money is to 49 and Jesus is to 19 on the billboard, on the winner board of which one's better. And I'm half of Jesus and money is to hear, to hear, And this is Jesus right here. People barely, barely respect Jesus more than money. They barely respect him. If you have a Bible, a King James Version, read it tonight. Read it every time you can. Because this summer, we're changing. We're going to... No devices. If you want to follow Jesus, do these a few of these things, okay? No devices. Spend half of your time with your family and outdoors. And read the Bible for him. And get to know him and his amazing father. It's all you have to do this summer. Literally. If you're bored... Reading a Bible is the most funnest thing you could ever do every day. I read my Bible more than you could imagine, more than I can imagine, more than Jesus could imagine. I don't spend time with it, mostly, but I hug it, I kiss it, I, I bring it to school with me to make sure I feel safe inside and feel like God and Jesus is right with me. That's what I do with my Bible, and I also read it. But that's not the only thing you should do with your Bible. You need to take care of it like it's a baby. you got to respect it like you would respect Jesus when he comes down to earth soon. Okay? That's all you have to do. And my blessing, I'm going to pray for you and me real quick. So listen closely. God and Jesus, please bless the people that have watched this and that have blessed everybody they know and have blessed for me because they are watching this video and listening to my words very closely. Pray that they are having an amazing day. Hope that they have their Bible and they have a Bible and they are getting to know you. They are going to churches. They are learning about you and your father, you and your son, whoever is listening to this. Please pray for the people behind the screens and please help them out for the rest of their lives like you always have. Give them many blessings for right now and hope that they are having an amazing day and 
holding their Bible if they have one or anything that has your name written all over it and your father's name or if you God you're listening to this or your son in you in Jesus name amen you're welcome for that I am you don't have to um say thank you for that prayer I just hope you have an amazing day and let Jesus and God bless you tonight and today Thank you for getting on this page and please make sure you have a make sure you take care of Bibles or a Bible and don't be like people back then because they used to spit they used to throw it around the Bible that they they used to kick around and everything with the Holy Bible. Don't be like those people be blessing and be kind. And respect Jesus and God your whole life. That's all you have to do. Just like ABC. A. Admit. Admit that Jesus is the Lord. And he is your Savior. B. Believe that he is lo your Lord and your King. And your Savior. C. Commit. Commit that he is Lord of lords and kings of kings. Thank you so much for re watching this. Hope you have an amazing day. Love you.